Hey everyone, this is Miss Olson. Today our library lesson is going to be a little bit different. In order to work through this lesson, you're going to have to go online and play a game that is sponsored by Google. If you're at home virtually, I need you to be sure and ask your parent if it is okay before you click the link above and get started. If your parent says no, that is fine. You will not be penalized in any way whatsoever. Please just enjoy 20 minutes of free reading today for library time instead. All right, if mom or dad says okay, let me tell you a little bit more about Google Interland. Interland is an adventure-packed online game for kids ages 7 through 12. Its purpose is to learn about digital safety and good citizenship. Your goal in the game is to help your fellow internauts combat badly behaved hackers, to sink fishers, to outsmart oversharers, and to one-up cyberbullies. And you're going to do this by practicing skills that you need to become a good digital citizen. All right, if mom and dad have said okay, you would click this link and then when the game opens up, you will click this one. Let's work through it together and see. All right, I'm going to put the link in. All you have to do is click to get here though. This is what you'll see when it opens up. Welcome to Interland, a magical place brimming with both awesome and blossom surprises. Embark on a quest to become a confident explorer of the online world. So here's our base and here's our internaut. That's your character for the game. Now, Interland consists of four floating islands. To become internet awesome, you need to work through these islands one by one. The order that you work through does not really matter to me, but a lot of people choose to start with the blue one. You can make that choice. Let's look at each island and I'll tell you what each one is about. The orange island is the Tower of Treasure. This is where we learn to secure our secrets. And a lot of the information that you'll be learning as you play in this island will con concern your passwords. The green island is key, Kind Kingdom, where it's cool to be kind. We're going to learn about being positive and being respectful to others as we work online. The next island is the red one. Reality River is on this island. On this island, we learn that we don't fall for fake. We watch out for fishers and scammers. And if you're not sure what those are, you'll learn all about it on this island. Finally, Mindful Mountain, where we learn to share with care. This means that we protect our personal information, things like our name, our address, our school. And all of these things together will teach us to be great digital citizens online. Now, if you keep clicking the arrows, you're going to go around and around and around. So what you need to do is pick a spot. And since I want you to be safe online, I'd like you to start with the Mindful Mountain, Share with Care. So as you click play, loading up, And here you have the land. The mountainous town center of Interland is a place where everyone mingles and crosses paths. Now, there's your little intronaut. And as he appears, you're going to get some instructions to read. And it's going to give you some hints about how to proceed. Do you remember how Miss Olson has told you over and over that every good story has a problem and a solution? Well, that is true in Interland. There's a problem for you to solve on every island. Be aware that the game does not save your progress. So if you leave Interland, you are going to have to start fresh every time. But that's okay. Interland was designed this way on purpose so that Google didn't have to ask for any child's personal information. 
You don't have to have a Google account or a login or any kind of password to be able to play. All right, I'm going to leave you with it there and I will check on your progress back in Seesaw. Thanks.